Hi there, my name is Melinda Elmer with Century 21 Masters and the Elmer team. Today, sharing common mistakes that many probate executors make and how to avoid them. This is a part of a series that I will share going forward. In this video, I'm gonna to touch on a few mistakes that many probate executors make in the process. The first of which is not having the right guidance or counsel to help you through the probate process. It all starts with filing that petition for probate and making sure that you either have a good attorney or a paralegal to help you with that paperwork. Ideally, finding an attorney that's going to help you settle the probate estate fairly and communicating with you often so that you know everything that's going on every step of the way. You can always find a good attorney through usprobateservices.org or your local bar association like the Long Beach Bar Association. You can click on the links below for both of those websites. I can, of course, also help you find a good attorney that I know will do a great job for you. I've worked with many probate attorneys over the years and will be happy to connect you with a good one. The second mistake that many administrators make is not having clarity on the entire probate process. What does this process look like? Well, if you already have an attorney, hopefully they've given you a timeline so you know what to expect. If not, I can also share a timeline of the process. Just reach out. The third mistake that a lot of administrators make is selecting the wrong service providers to help them liquidate the estate and prepare it for sale. So this is where you can contact an estate appraisal company that may purchase everything, or you may wanna donate everything to charity. It is possible that there are things that are unique and possibly really valuable like artwork or rare books. In those cases, it may be better to go to an estate auctioneer. These are all things that I can help you with. Also, there are options of what to do with the real estate. Do you want it to go to a family member? Do you want to hold on to the property and keep it as a rental? Do you sell it as is? Do you fix it up and then sell it? There are pros and cons to each situation, and I can help you walk through the process to see what makes the most sense for you and the estate. You can count on me to give you the clarity as to all your options, so you feel you're making the right decision. If you have questions or you know someone who is working through being a probate administrator, please feel free to forward and share this video. You can reach me at 562-316-2915 or melinda at theelmerteam.com. You can also visit our website at elmerteamprobate.net for more information. Thank you so much for watching and please feel free to forward and share this with your friends.